So today we are at uh, iRep Detail Supply in um, Kaneohe. And um, my goal for today is to kind of show how you can shoot an event. So today they have their um, two year um, anniversary of the shop being open. Um, Kaika is a friend of mine, go way back from our days at uh, 24 Hour Fitness. So I, I shoot all of their events or you know the events that I can make it to. What I want to show today is that um, kind of what I've been doing over the years um, with event shooting is usually I only shoot with one camera body and one lens. Um, granted, the type of shooting that I do is kind of low stakes. I'm just kind of wandering around, um, grabbing shots and putting together highlight videos. I will pull uh, people aside and do a little bit of um, you know, interview style stuff to sprinkle in with the highlight video. But um, what I want to show is that you don't need a whole lot to have um, a quote unquote professional videography business. Like I've been a one man, one person um, videography crew, if you will, um, for, the, for almost a decade now. And lately my weapon of choice is the Sony ZV-E1 and the 24 millimeter f 2.8 uh, mostly because the whole setup is very small and um, with the 24 millimeter um, I use clear image zoom to punch into 35 millimeters so I kind of have two lenses in one um, f 2.8 it's enough of a shallow depth of field um, to get you know nice shots what I use for audio aside from the onboard microphone um, with the built-in dead cat. I have a wireless mic set up from Hollyland. This is the Lark M1. Uh, these are what I use when I want to do like real quick on the spot interview type things. And that's all I have really. Um, I don't use a tripod. Everything is handheld, no gimbals, anything. Um, as far as controlling exposure, I have these uh, magnetic um, ND filters from KNF. I just wanted to take some time before I get out there and start shooting to uh, talk to those of you out there that want to start like a videography business, whether it's part time or full time, that you don't need a lot of equipment. Uh, this is a great camera. It's not the cheapest camera, but I like that I can get a professional image in a very small package. Um, these are excellent microphones. That's all you need. Anyway, that's it for this video. I uh, hope this helps someone out there. At the very least, hopefully it was entertaining. And as always, thanks for watching.